I'd be happy either way. They got money, they got fame. Everybody knows one of their names, either one or the other. Who wouldn't want to be Hugo? Carpets, Tiffany lamps, antique chairs. I'm serious. It was a beautiful setup in a backyard house concert. And so it's great to have you here, Hugo. Hugo showed up last year. Uh, Jim Whaley drug him here. He says he came on his own. I was coming to see you. He come said on. he came on his own. Jim Whaley says he drug him here and made him come. But we were so glad. It was so many people's favorite day last year. And uh, uh, I think you should do us a song. Okay. You guys. Right. I know you got a new one, actually. I ain't gonna do it. All right. <laughs> I just want to thank Tom Shepard for making me look so damn short all the time. Yeah. <laughs> He's got an extender on his hat. <laughs> or under it, I'm not sure. Is it possible to get a bottle of water or something? We, we got it. You got any pull here? Yep. I can't help but to be about to steal corrosions. <laughs> It's hot, Kelly's gone fishing I'm still loaded from the mission last night Twenty-one of the coconut commandos Raided the chart room and did it upright I'm going down to Louis for a cold one Dodging the holes that they put in the street Oh, Ken Cates, as it gets you in the long run I need the hair of the dog that got me the old sailor's logbook is yellowed and brittle, the pages are falling apart. But he's saving these moments for the rest of his life, walked away in his Key West heart. Captain Jim's gonna take us all sailing He's got the prettiest crew that I know 11 a.m. will be on the dock waiting If he wakes up, we'll be ready to go We're gonna sail this boat down to the island Romping the sun and the clean ocean air In a few days, we'll be headed for the pier house Flashing the tourist on Mallory Logbook is yellowed and brittle, the pages are falling apart. But he's saving these moments for the rest of his life, locked away in his key west heart. Out on the ocean, the boat is softly singing, the stars are putting on a show. The night watch bell is ringing, sailing into the harbor. My little town is all alone. I get a feeling I can't explain. I gotta let it be sure. And I'm going down to see my friends at the raw bar. Having no money is the son of a bitch. But I don't care. I've got Kelly's visa. Let's go somewhere else and pretend that we're rich. Sweet Pete and Barry are making the rounds and they're drinking and joking till late in the night. Most is a ship that I'm waiting on to hear in the cold and the commandos are feeling all right. This old sailor's memory is faded and fragile, my photos are falling apart. But I'm saving these moments for the rest of my life, locked away in my Key West heart. Key West heart. Uh, 
uh, give it up for Tom Shepard here. Glad to be here today, Kelly. Thanks, man. I, I lose track of how many cuts and hits you've had in your songwriting, and uh, but, uh, do some of them for us. Okay. Well, would you like to hear something new or something old? Yeah, we'll do something. Well, let's, let's hear both, but do them at different times. All right. Here's a brand new one. I have a brand new CD I just finished, and it's uh, we'll be here tonight. It's coming in on a on a plane with a hot chick bringing it down. Isn't it funny how we all have CDs. How, how many of you have been to a, a, a CD release party where the CDs were showing up that afternoon or maybe the night before? Yes, always. Now, you think I'm gonna have two months to get it done from the time? Invariably. You Every were time. keeping your fingers crossed FedEx doesn't screw up or That's something. That's true. Now, I don't know how Jim Morris does it. You know, scheduling the CD release party, well, you're lucky they came in. Mike well, Broward's new CDs are back there. Anyway, Tom, go ahead. This is a new one. This is one that I wrote with my good friend Kevin Fowler that I've had a lot of songs. He's recorded five of my songs, and we've had uh, we've written some other ones. I think you were gonna, I'm going to have a few more on his new record. But this song was inspired by being on the road for six days with this guy in Texas named Josh Abbott. I went out on the road to write with him, and we didn't get anything accomplished except drinking every day Imagine heavily, till, sometimes till the sun came up. And I'm so, so shocked. So on the seventh day, on the seventh day, I had a gig in Austin area at this place called Poopy's Hilltop, and it was like a little mini festival with me and Billy Joe Shaver and uh, Larry Joe Taylor was there, Gary P. Nunn, all the three name guys. These these name droppers, man. Yeah. So I wasn't going to drink that day. 